So the Justice League is the definitive superhero team for the DC Universe, and it's full of characters, over a hundred. But here are the top 10 most powerful Justice League members. Number 10 is Wonder Woman. Now Wonder Woman is one of the most powerful superheroes in the DC Universe, and her powers are a result of the blessing from the gods. She is nearly as strong as Superman and Captain Marvel and has moved one third of the Earth before, along with Superman and Martian Manhunter. When she removes her braces, she taps into a new level of power and goes into a berserker rage. She can also fly and move at superhuman speeds, and the Flash had said that she can easily keep up with him. She's also durable enough to battle Superman and gods, and has enough stamina to fight forever. Now Diana is the new god of war, and this allows her to telepathically communicate and control all soldiers on the planet. Wonder Woman is also an expert at combat, and Batman described her as the best melee fighter in the DC Universe. She also has magical items such as the Lasso of Truth, Bracelets of Victory, Royal Tiara, Battle Armor, and a Magical Sword. Number 9 is Hal Jordan. So Hal Jordan possesses the single greatest weapon in the entire DC Universe, a Lantern Ring. He is also one of the best Green Lanterns in the entire core. Because of the ring, Hal is able to create energy constructs from hard light energy. The ring can also project beams, form protective bubbles and force fields, and fire destructive blasts. The ring also has inner programming, which can be executed without the user's permission. An example is the auto shield, which automatically protects the user from external harm and has even been capable of protecting someone from planetary level attacks. The ring can also allow the user to achieve incredible speeds in flight, manipulate matter, phase through objects, and create wormholes. A Green Lantern can also absorb someone else's power. In JLA's first fight with Amazo, it was GL who defeated him by drawing out all of Amazo's power. Number 8 is Barry Allen. So Barry's primary power is super speed, which he gets from tapping into the speed force. His speed is potentially limitless, it just depends on his connection to the speed force. Barry is able to control his body on a molecular level, which lets him phase through objects and people. Flash is also able to create vortexes by running in circles. These can be used to suffocate an enemy, send a person to another dimension, or create a barrier. Flash is also able to steal someone's kinetic energy and create an infinite mass punch. If Flash runs fast enough, he gains the relative mass of a white dwarf star and is able to deliver a crushing blow. Number 7 is Firestorm. So Firestorm is composed of two people, Ronnie Raymond and Jason Rush, and can change freely between them. So while both people have strengths and weaknesses, I'm going to count them as one, since they can switch at will. Now Firestorm has the ability to rearrange the atomic and subatomic structure of inorganic and organic matter. He rearranges the subatomic particles to create objects of different atomic characteristics of equal mass. He can actually rearrange matter just by looking at it. He can also change his person at will, which allows him to regenerate lost and damaged tissue and shapeshift. Firestorm can also turn intangible and phase through objects and manipulate energy. He can shoot concussive force blasts and powerful fusion blasts. Firestorm also has enhanced strength, up to 100 tons, and can fly at insanely fast speeds. So number 6 is Captain Marvel, otherwise known as Shazam. Now Billy Batson is empowered by the gods and has the powers of Solomon, Hercules, Atlas, Zeus, Achilles, and Mercury. He's matched Superman, Wonder Woman, and Black Adam in strength, and his strength limits are unknown. Shazam can fight forever, and has virtually limitless superman, superhuman endurance. He has the power of Zeus that augments all his other abilities and gives him magical resistance, and the ability to use lightning bolts as weapons. Shazam is also incredibly durable, and is virtually invulnerable to all forms of physical harm. He's also incredibly fast and is able to rival the speed of Superman and the Flash. Number 5 is Wally West. So Wally West was the sidekick to Barry Allen until he took over as the official Flash after Barry's death. In my opinion, Wally's the stronger Flash and here's why. He was the creator of the infinite mass punch and he first learned the ability to steal someone else's speed. 
While Barry probably has the ability to do these as well, Wally was the first to learn them and has shown overall greater creativity in his use of the Speed Force. He's also shown the best speed feats and has demonstrated better control of the Speed Force for longer. Number 4 is Captain Atom. Captain Atom is one of the most powerful heroes in the DC Universe and is able to manipulate the quantum field. He is able to absorb, generate, and manipulate infinite amounts of energy and matter. Although he is able to use this with limitless potential, he usually uses it to enhance his physical abilities and manipulate energy and matter. He is as strong and durable as Superman and is able to shoot extremely powerful energy projections and is second to none when it comes to energy absorption. He is also able to manipulate matter in reality and has even created his own universe in the quantum field before. Captain Atom regularly holds back from universal level to just planetary level, but he is one of the most powerful characters in the entire DC universe. Number 3 is Superman. Now Superman is the definitive powerhouse in the DC universe and is really the bar that everyone is compared to. He has immense super strength and has been able to move the earth all by himself and even lifted the book of eternity before, which is infinite in its weight. Superman is able to fly and move at incredibly fast speeds. He's even able to keep up with the flash before. He's able to shoot highly concentrated beams of thermal energy out of his eyes, which are comparable to temperatures produced by stars. He's also able to expel large amounts of air from his lungs and lower the temperature of this air, causing it to be sub-zero temperatures. Finally, he has immense durability and only attacks from beings as powerful as Darkseid and Doomsday have been shown to hurt him. Number 2 is Martian Manhunter. Now Martian Manhunter possesses powers and abilities that all Martians have, but he has shown to be the most powerful of his race. He has super strength comparable to Superman and has helped to move the entire earth before. He is also extremely durable and is fast enough to keep up with the Flash. He has regenerative powers, even being able to regrow his body from a very small mass in an extremely short period of time. He also has complete control of his molecular structure, which allows him to greatly grow in size and shapeshift into anything he desires. He is also able to become invisible, intangible, and phase through objects and opponents. John is one of the most powerful telepaths on earth and is even able to affect the spectrum with his telepathy. Martian Manhunter is able to fire sonic blasts and create psionic shields. He has extremely powerful telekinesis, although he usually likes to keep this power in reserve. He also has Martian vision and Martian breath, much like Superman's heat vision and freeze breath. So before I get to our number one pick, I would like to throw out an honorable mention, the Phantom Stranger. So the Phantom Stranger is kind of an unofficial member of the Justice League because he was offered a membership, but he never officially accepted it. With that being said, if he were a member of the League, he would definitely be the most powerful. He is able to teleport over huge distances, manipulate cosmic power on a huge scale, and he is a master of magic on a ginormous scale. He also possesses vast knowledge and nigh omniscience, which means he knows everything about any character or situation he encounters. It's also theorized that he cannot be killed because the universe protects his presence or by his unique defensive powers. So I would say the most powerful Justice League member is, wait for it, Dr. Fate. Dr. Fate is an incredibly powerful sorcerer and his powers come from Naboo who possesses the helmet of Fate. Dr. Fate is able to project his body on the astral plane which allows his soul to possess others and able to fire blast of energy. He's able to manipulate time, travel between dimensions, create energy constructs, and deliver incredibly powerful magical blasts. He's able to create forest fields powerful enough to stop Aquarius for an entire week. For those that don't know, Aquarius is an incredibly powerful living star. Dr. Fake can cast complicated illusions heal himself and others, hypnotize people, and has the ability to turn invisible. He's able to manipulate matter and gravity, 
and can even call upon demons and the dead. Finally, Dr. Fate knows the true name of Ra and can use his divine power to augment and amplify his own. That's my list. What do y'all think? Sound off in the comments down below. Let me know. And be sure to hit the subscribe button for more videos like this every week. Did you know that the creation of the Justice League actually inspired Marvel to create the Avengers? So in a way, the Justice League created their own competition? The more you know. You can easily keep up with him. She's also durable enough to battle Superman and gods, and has enough stamina to fight forever. Now Diana is the new god of war, and this allows her to telepathically communicate and control all soldiers on the planet. Wonder Woman is also an expert at combat, and Batman described her as the best melee fighter in the DC Universe. And Hal is able to create energy constructs from hard light energy. The ring can also project beams, form protective bubbles and force fields, and fire destructive blasts. The ring also has inner programming, which can be executed without the user's permission. An example is the auto shield, which automatically so the Justice League is the definitive superhero team for the DC Universe, and it's full of characters, over a hundred. But here are the top 10 most powerful Justice League members. Number 10 is Wonder Woman. Now Wonder Woman is one of the most powerful superheroes in the DC Universe, and her powers are a result of the blessing from the gods. She is nearly as strong as Superman and Captain Marvel, and has moved one third of the Earth before along with Superman and Martian Manhunter. When she removes her braces, she taps into a new level of power and goes into a berserker rage. She can also fly and move at superhuman speeds, and the Flash had said that she she also has magical items such as the Lasso of Truth, Bracelets of Victory, Royal Tiara, Battle Armor, and a Magical Sword. Number 9 is Hal Jordan. So Hal Jordan possesses the single greatest weapon in the entire DC Universe, a Lantern Ring. He is also one of the best Green Lanterns in the entire core. Because of the 